Here's a word problem where we're going to use a Venn diagram to solve. Here's a list of some famous people on whom the FBI kept files. We have the list of famous people and then the length of the FBI file listed to the right. Bud Abbott, who was an entertainer, had 14 pages. Charlie Chaplin, an entertainer, had 2,063 pages. Albert Einstein, a scientist, had 1,800 pages. Martin Luther King, Jr., a civil rights leader, had 17,000 pages. Elvis Presley, an entertainer, had 663 pages. Jackie Robinson, an athlete, had 131 pages. Eleanor Roosevelt, the first lady and a UN representative, had 3,000 pages. Frank Sinatra, an entertainer, had 1,275 pages. Now, the data can be organized in the following Venn diagram. U, the universal set, is equal to the set of people on whom the FBI kept files. And we notice that we have three different sets designated. We have files that were greater than 2,000 pages, and that includes regions 1, 2, 4, and 5. We have entertainers, that would be in regions 1, 2, 3, 5, and 6. And we have the set of men, regions 4, 5, 6, and 7. And then, of course, region 8 would be that region which doesn't include anything in these three sets. The question is to try to determine the region in the Venn diagram into which each of the following people should be placed. So we're going to go through each of these individually, beginning with Charlie Chaplin. So let's go back and notice that we have, again, three sets. File has to be greater than 2,000 pages, entertainers, and men. Well, we know that Charlie Chaplin was an entertainer, and he was also a man. Now let's look at how long his file was. His file was 2,063 pages long. And for that reason, he's an entertainer who was a man who had a file greater than 2,000 pages, meaning that his element, that element would be in region 5. So we're going to say that the region in which he would be placed would be region 5. The second person that we're going to consider is Albert Einstein. Now, Einstein was a scientist, and he was a man. Let's see where he would be placed. Well, he would be in the circle for men, but we still have a number of different regions to try to decide upon. We know he's not an entertainer, so we could eliminate these two regions. We just need to figure out how long his file was. Albert Einstein had a file of 1,800 pages. Now, 1,800 pages is less than 2,000. So if we look back at our list, we had determined that he would have to be in either Region 4 or Region 7. His file is not greater than 2,000, so therefore he's going to end up being in Region 7. So let's list that next. Moving on, we'll look at Martin Luther King, Jr. Now, Martin Luther King, Jr. was not an entertainer. He was a man. Back on our list, we're trying to determine then if he's in region four or seven, depends on the length of his file. Martin Luther King Jr. had 17,000 pages, which is certainly larger than 2,000. So he's going to end up in region four. Let's list that next. Now we're going to Eleanor Roosevelt. Well, Eleanor Roosevelt was not a man. She was not an entertainer. How long was her file? Eleanor Roosevelt's file was 3,000 pages long. So she needs to be included in this circle where the file is greater than 2,000 pages. She cannot be part of the circle for entertainers. She cannot be part of the circle for men. In fact, she's going to end up being in Region 1. And finally, Frank Sinatra. Frank Sinatra was an entertainer. He was a man and his file was less than 2,000 pages. Let's see where that region would be. He was an entertainer, he was a man. He's either in five or six. His file was less than 2,000 pages, so therefore it will be in region six.